Urgent, now it is clear who is responsible for this, there will be no more tolerance, sign up and understand the report. Disappointment was in the air Sunday after the San Francisco 49ers blew a 13-point halftime lead in their 24-23 loss to the Arizona Cardinals at Levi's Stadium, and even though the team needed to put it behind them quickly with a game against the Seattle Seahawks coming in four days, there was still plenty of head-scratching to go around following the game. Turnovers in the second half, two interceptions, one fumble, one turnover on downs, played the biggest role in the loss as the 49ers managed to go scoreless in the third and fourth quarters without being forced to punt. The 49ers couldn't cash in on opportunities to seal the game and in turn left the door wide open for the Cardinals to steal a victory on a late field goal. The 49ers entered Sunday's game with a 50% rate of scoring touchdowns in the red zone and didn't help themselves in that regard, coming away with one touchdown, two field goals and a fumble in four trips. Purdy put much of the blame on his own shoulders when discussing the issue on Sunday. Everything's pretty tight. It's close, and we just got to be aggressive. And obviously it starts with me, Purdy said. I'm the guy with the ball, being aggressive to certain guys and matchups and giving guys chances, and so I just gotta be hard on myself with that. Obviously, you want to be smart and protect the ball, but, you know, when we got a matchup and a good look, we gotta rip it. So, I just gotta be better and more aggressive down there and then just collectively as a unit, offensive unit, once we get down there, like all of us, our mindset has to be, we gotta punch this in, obviously, we know we can settle for field goal. We've got to hold ourselves to a higher standard and cross the goal line. Not helping the 49ers this season has been the absence of McCaffrey, who has been a go-to player in the red zone since his arrival in the Bay Area in 2022. But Purdy thinks the 49ers have more than enough tools to improve their performance. Obviously you can do so much with Christian out of the backfield, line him up as a receiver and stuff like that, and defenses have to account and have a plan for that. So, I mean, it is a little different, Purdy said. But regardless, man, I think we have, you know, the players and the talent to still make it, make it happen. And we got some, obviously got George with his size, Debo, Brandon Ayuk with their hands, JJ Jawan Jenkins, so we've just got to put it together and get some rhythm within it down there. Comment what bothered you most in this frustrating 49ers game, stay tuned for future updates.